It ain't no, if it's two spirits, the devil got you. Amen. But we got to be on one accord yes. where there is unity. Amen. Who is that said, behold how good and how pleasant it is for brethren to dwell together in unity. It is like the dude that ran down on Herman's beard. I don't can remember the other, but that's a precious anointing. Yeah. Can you imagine the, the coolness of the anointing? Coming down upon you. Amen. Let the peace of God Amen. rule Amen. in your heart. Yes. Come on, come on, come on. 16 verse. Mm. Let the word of Christ. Let the peace of God. Dwell in you richly. No. Rule in your heart. This is what mine says. Oh, 16 verse. Oh. You said 15. No, I said 16. Oh, yeah, yeah, you okay, go ahead. Let the word of Christ Let the word of Christ dwell in you richly. Let it be rich. Run it over. Yes. When it run over, that means it don't touch somebody else's well, life. Yeah, Amen. It's gonna just like he said, run it over, shaking that what did what the scripture said? About the run over, shaking, press down, run over, press down and run it over. That's awesome, ain't it? Amen. Amen. Let the word of God dwell in you richly in all wisdom. Teaching. Teaching. And admonishing. Admonishing. One another. Admonish you to keep on going. Yeah. Be strong in the Lord. Yes. And the power of his might. Now listen. You got to put on the whole armor. Not half of it. The whole armor. The whole armor of God that you might be able to do what? We'll stand the wiles. What is the wiles? The tricks and the trade that the devil got to offer you. He'll yeah. trick you right out of your blessing if you Amen. ain't careful. Yes, yes. He will. Yes, yes. Oh, yes. Right out when he tricks Amen. you. Amen. Read. Admonishing one another. Admonishing one another. In psalms. In psalms. In hymns. In hymns. In spiritual songs. In spiritual songs. Singing with grace. Singing with grace. In your heart. In your heart to, to the Lord. Lord. Get you a song when the enemy come up at you. Get you a, one of those genuine break down, knock down hymns. That's all right. Take me to the water. Hallelujah. Take me to the water. Sometimes we need to be baptized and watch some stuff off of. I don't know why he gave me that song, but that's what it Yes. Says. It's in order. Amen. Yes. It's in order. Amen. Yeah. Because if you have did something wrong, I think Ellen and them got some pools around here somewhere. They'll find one. That's right. Dip you in the water. Get some Amen. of that. Get you washed up. Clean up. Yes. For well, the king. We just baptized uh, one, two, three, four, four. Wednesday night. Four. Went down there in cold water. One of the devil tried it. Keep her, make her lose her cool, and she sit down in that water a little bit. She jumped up. She said, oh, no, I can't do this. We encourage her to go down. And so the husband-to-be got in the front of her, went down and sit down in that water just like nothing flat. And guess what? I said, honey, you go home, you're going to be like I was. I said, when my husband got the Holy Ghost, I didn't want to sleep in his face. I said, well, you're going to be wishing you had a wet down there when you get back home and you don't have this baptism. She turned around and made up her mind and went down like a champ and got it done in Jesus' name. Yes. All right? Where we at, Ellen? 17 verse. 17 verse. And whatsoever ye do in word, whatsoever you do in word, or deed, or deed, do all, do it all in the name of the Lord Jesus. And do it all in the name of the Lord Jesus. Giving thanks to God. Giving thanks to God. In the Father. And the Father. By Him. By Him. Whatsoever you do and say. First Corinthians ten and three. I'm, I'm about to round it up. I'm almost finished, y'all. First Corinthians ten and three. Mm-hmm. And did ye? Excuse me. And did all eat? And did all eat in the same spirit? In the same spirit. Meat. What is it? Meat. 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 So you're going to do it all in God. Yes. By Him. Amen. 
Whatever we say or do, do it in the name of Jesus. Yes. Wholehearted to him. Read down. We got a few more verses. We're going to bring it in. 18. Wives. Wives. Submit yourselves. Submit yourselves. Unto your own husband. Unto your own husband. See, sometimes we go after other folks' husbands. You need to go at your own. Now, he telling you, wives, submit yourselves unto your own. If you don't have one, then you got to wait. Because hey, hey. you sure can't have mine. Amen. All right now. Wives, submit yourselves unto your own husband. And this is what? As it is fit. Now, in the this Lord. is fit in the Lord. Amen. Now, read. 19. Husbands. Husband. Love your wives. Love your wives. And be not bitter. And be not bitter against them. Against them. Ephesians 5 and 25. Y'all bear with me. I'm just about ending up. Coming into the landing. Husbands. Husband. Love your wives. Love your wives. Even as Christ also. As Christ. Love the church. Love the church. Has loved the church. And gave himself for and it. And he gave himself for the church. Amen. We are the church. I'm so glad he went to Calvary and hung there Amen. for your sins and mine. Amen. He gave himself That's for the church. Amen. And we, the body of Christ, is the church. Yes. I'm glad he did. Yeah, God. I was in a mess. I was messed up. Hi, God. On my way to, to die in hell. Yes, that was him. But you know, I was reading the scripture. I forgot where it was, but they, they said, when you go against the word of God and you go to hell, there's a worm. You got a worm and never die. Yes. It's in Revelation. Mm -hmm. That worm always alive. He's running up your nose and your eyes and your ears and running down in your belly and everything. And that's, when you think about that, that's something crazy. Yeah. So if you don't want your worm in hell, don't go there. Because if you go there, you got one. He said that worm will never die. So we want long as we in Christ and keep our ourselves. He said, if you can keep your head, <laughs> that's the main thing. We'll in a day now the devil make you lose your cool in a minute. I don't care if you say, I don't care how long you've been saved. He's going to work on your nerve. He'll work on your nerve till you get you out of God's will. And next day you be, you had to be going somewhere trying to repent. So just take it easy. You had to repent. Be cool. <laughs> Don't lose your head. Amen. Don't 